Boys and girls, now let's practice the oral reading part of the reading fluency practice. The oral reading button is on the right. It has a picture of an open storybook. Find the oral reading button and click or tap the picture. Hi, today we're going to do some special work on the computer. Let's check it out. You're going to read out loud into your microphone. First, we need to make sure I can hear you. Click the green circle, then say, I am ready. I am ready. Now, I'll show you a whole story. Click the green circle when you're ready to start. Click it again when you finish reading. Now, boys and girls, instead of just saying the sentence, I am ready, we'll click the green button and your iPad will listen to you read the story on the screen. Start reading out loud. Ken wakes up. He is still in bed. The sun is up, but the shade is down. Now click the green button with the arrow to move to the next page. Ken gets out of bed. He opens the shade. The street looks very odd. It is all white. Why is the road all white, he asks. His mom smiles. Today is a snow day. You're doing great. Let's do something a little different. Read the sentence and find the matching picture. You can read silently if you want to. Choose a picture for your answer. So now I read the sentence and click the picture that matches the sentence. The dog sits. Read the sentence. A bug lands on the cup. She can play in the pool. You're a rock star. Here's something new. Next, I'll show you a whole passage. Do your best reading. Afterwards, I'll ask you some questions. Click the green circle when you're ready to start. Click it again when you finish reading. So boys and girls, when you're ready, click the green button. And just like before, the iPad will listen to you read the story out loud. Start reading out loud. My aunt is having a baby. There is a big party for the baby. My family is going to the party. My mom said it will be fun. I am not so sure. My mom said it will be a nice party. She said we will dress up. Oh no, I know what that means, party clothes. I do not like party clothes. I like my everyday clothes. I like my soft pants. I like my gym shoes. I like my soft t-shirt. I like it when my hair sticks up. I do not like party clothes. My party pants are too stiff. I can't run fast in them. My party shoes are too stiff. They feel tight. They squish my toes. My mom fixes my hair. My party hair is too stiff. My shirt is too stiff and it is too white. Mom will say, do not spill food on your nice white shirt. Food, I forgot about the food. I do like party food. Yum, I will get cake. I could eat mom's frosting too. Maybe I can get two pieces. I do not like my party clothes, but I will wear party clothes for cake. Where is the family going in the story? Remember, use the speaker button to hear the choices. To the store. To school. To a party. To a game. What type of clothes does the writer like? How did the writer describe his party pants and shoes? Too hot. 
too loose, too shiny, too stiff. Great work. That's all for today. See you next time. When you're finished, boys and girls, click the green hooray button and you will go back to the main screen.